What's good ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I had to bring you a quick update video to let you know what the heck is going on, where the hell I've been at, and of course, when it's an update video, it's going to be a my career video, my career, sorry, my career, yeah, it's technically a my career video, but it's in the Jordan Rec Center, or it's going to be in the my parks, so this one of course is the Jordan Rec Center, and I have to say, I go off in this one. I think this is the most points I get in the game. You will see it as we continue on through. But just before I talk about the rec center and whatnot and all that stuff and all these other things I want to talk about, just got to give you guys a quick heads up. Um, this is my last week in university, and I got some work due in, and I got an exam on Wednesday. But I couldn't leave you guys without a video. And I was thinking about making a My Career video, but that is very time consuming in actually editing because about my career video is about an hour and 15 minutes long or so and then you have to like scrub through all the footage chop it down edit it up and that takes about another what hour and a bit so you know we're looking about roughly two hours if we're including the whole thumbnail editation editation yeah thumbnail editing and stuff for the like, youtube videos uh so that will make a short return i said short return that will make a return shortly is what i'm trying to say so keep your eyes peeled like bananas when yeah you peel a banana yeah so that makes sense I was gonna say something else that Filthy Frank said and that was just nasty what he said um, if you follow Filthy Frank you know what he said I'm just saying guys it's freaking air anyway back to this gameplay real quick um like I say whenever I have a big performance I don't realize when I want to have a big performance and I always hit the record button just way too late so that's something to see, because sometimes when I do have a big performance in the early quarters, something stupid happens. Like, if you guys follow me on Twitch, which I advise you do, Twitch TV, uh, the 1829, I'm pretty sure the link is in the description box below if you don't know, or if you want to get a straight directional link to the actual website. Uh, be sure to follow me on there, because I was streaming a My Career video. I say a My Career video, I was streaming a My Career mode the other night, about two nights ago, and I actually had a huge performance, which I did record. So prepare to see a lot more things, a lot more things. I say a lot more huge performances coming from the my career. And oh, that was just a nasty call. I don't know why I always do that. I always seem to get this offensive basket interference. I always miss time the triangle rebounding button. Hey, just is what it is. I gotta really learn to box out and shit. But yeah. So yeah, if you follow me on uh, Twitch TV, you'll see what's happened. And of course, Twitch has recently started saving my broadcasts. So uh, if you just want to see it without any like pure editing. And I don't think you'll be able to hear my voice because I was mucking around and yeah, uh, I didn't really set the audio levels right. And you could just only hear me like, <laughs> like that, but with a game audio like really strongly dubbed over. Yeah, then you can go ahead and check it out. Uh, of course, there are other videos that they're saved on Twitch, uh, like Last of Us. I'm playing with that. I'm playing that with John. Whenever I go down to his, we do stream that. Um, yeah. Anyway. <laughs> I'm um, looking outside the window and thinking, what else do I need to say? I should really write this shit down. And speaking of writing shit down, I have written something and put a sticky note on the wall. And this is a new idea that I'm trying to come like to grips with. And I'm going to try and do it in the, in the upcoming weeks leading to New Year. New Year? New Year. Cannot speak. What the heck is going on? This is what happens when you don't speak in a while. I mean, my last, I think my last gameplay might have been a live gone. Could be very wrong about that. Let's just fast forward a little bit into this game. You can see they're starting to catch up a little bit. But we're going to have to do what we're going to have to do. And not play defense, but that's okay. That's alright. We're going we're gonna to do what we're going to do and finish with a high performance. Because we're going to get the ball right here. Dash down the court. Absorbing the contact. No and one. We go to the free throw to earn our points from the line. I think we only finished with one free throw made from this actual free throw set that does occur right here. Uh, what else is in the news? Kobe Bryant officially passes Michael Jordan as the third all-time maybe on the scoring list. The third-time NBA player in the scoring list of the NBA. You know what I'm trying to say. Did you guys watch that game? It was, uh, it was pretty intense, eh? I say intense, but I didn't. I only watched the first couple of seconds when Kobe got the ball. A couple of seconds? A couple of minutes, man. How can you watch the first couple of seconds and be like, oh, you know, fuck it, I, I don't care about this shit. I'm out. Because it was history in the making. I was like, okay, let me watch this shit. And you just see Kobe trying to do his thing. His first couple of shots missed, and then he started going from like those fading, leading jump shots he does from like just roughly near the paint area, near about 14, 15 feet. He's like, okay, let's get it. And he got his like uh, passing mark at the free throw line, which is the same way he got his first two NBA points. He didn't foul right there, he didn't send back to the line. Gotta do what we gotta do, man. Gotta do what we gotta do to get the points from the line. 
Uh, yeah, but originally when I was watching that game, I was watching the Bulls game before, and this was all happening when I was back down at John's house. He was like, come over, watch the game, we'll kick it, do our shit. So, you know, we're kicking it, me and the guys, we're just kicking and watching the game, chatting our usual stuff. And I was like, okay, it's Bulls versus Heat, and this is going to be interesting to see. There's no Chris Bosh, there's no Joe Kim Noah, let's see what happens here. And, of course, Bulls come through with a... I don't know if any of you guys actually watched it, but they come through with a win. And I didn't want to say anything in case people were like, Oh, I didn't mean to watch that game. You just ruined that game for me, man. I, I don't know why you talk like that. It's just, the, it's just the way I imagine some people talking. I'm weird like that. But, yeah, the Bulls come through with a win. Derrick Rose had a cold start. I was watching. I was like, he's about to go off for another 31 like he did last night against Portland. Nope, not going to be able to do it. But, hey, it's cool. I think he finished with about 16 points. Something like that. But yeah, that is pretty much it, and I don't know what else to say. Oh yeah, Manny Pacquiao and Floyd May Mayweather are finally about to fight. What do you guys think about that? That's completely off topic. That's something interesting to see, because uh, I know Pacquiao has been wanting to fight Floyd Mayweather for a long time, and I think he's the only guy that's really going to give Floyd, May Floyd Mayweather a huge challenge. He might actually get Floyd Mayweather, and to be honest with you, I hope he does. <laughs> anyway. Let me know what you guys' thoughts are about that fight, and I will see you guys next time. Till then, I have a second channel called The 1829 TV. I'm on Facebook, Twitter, everything you see on the screen, go check it out. And of course, I'm on Vine. Be sure to follow me on Vine. Till then, peace.